Okay, what tasks does he want doing? What's his assignment? To acquire and use a focus potion, acquire maxima and endurance potions and use them simultaneously. Okay, you want me to be Rebellion. a potion guy. Alright, so that tells me there's gonna be... Oh, you! This way. Go on then. Alright, go on. I'm gonna slap you right in. Got you. House token. Got. Ooh, another one of you. Uh, go on then, I know you're gonna go this way and up here, and then this way and then to here. Go on. Get in there. Right. Oh, slap. Slap. Got ya. Another token. Mm. Here you are. Go on then. Take me where you need to take me. Go on. Further up, was it? There we go. Mm, now. Nope. Got you. You here. Rebellion. I just swear I saw the fat fryer. But he disappeared. Hello, Professor Rock. Sir, why do I need to complete these tasks again? Professor Weasley has asked that we all contribute extra time to help you catch up to your peers. Right. And before right. I teach you to pulso, I must know that you are prepared to handle it. Hmm. Okay, so he wants me to do some brewing. I don't think I know the others. He, I need a Maxima potion. Purchase from J. Pickens potions. Hmm, I think I'll do that right now then. There you are. Field guide page helps me to community garden. Rebellion. In the market for potions, are we? Yes, I need. I'll actually get rid of some other stuff as well. Get rid of that. Very good. Never hurts to keep my stocks replenished. I need a focus potion. I think I remember that. A wise decision. Thank and you. And a maxima potion. Thank you. I hope to see you again. This Mutabia barrels. Ah, here we go. Dung bomb. The three broomsticks. Oh my god, there's more. Whatever, let's talk to this lady first. Hello, Clementine Willardsy. Pardon me, but were you saying something? Oh, hello. Talking to myself. I'm Clementine Willardsy. Charmed. I was musing on the precious butterflies I see near the edge of the forest. Whenever I come near, they fly off into it. When I was at Hogwarts, we truly were forbidden from entering the forest. I went just to be told horrible stories about it, and I've had an irrationally intense fear of it ever since. Right. It's silly, 
but I'm insatiably curious as to where the butterflies go in the forest. You couldn't possibly find out, could you? You want me to follow the butterflies? I do, um, yes, if you wouldn't mind. I suppose I could. What did you hear about the forest? What were the horrible stories you were told about the Forbidden Forest? Oh, goodness, everything from students being mysteriously beheaded to terrifying spider dens. I oh, did just fight some trust spiders. Me, you hear that at 11 years old, it sticks with you. I'll think about very it. well. If I have time, I shall see where they lead. Oh, how kind. Students these days have so much more courage than I ever did. You can usually find me right around here. I hope to see you soon. Yep, you too. See ya. Don't forget, the butterflies always seem to be on the fringes of the forbidden forest. Rebellion. Oh, yeah. Honey Dukes. Here we go. Exploding bonbons. Where do you go? I definitely said there you go. What are you? Spell it out. Nope. Tiggle's not Lumos. Lumos is there. Mm, literally down the road somewhere. You're right. Here you go. Right, come on, you. Alright, you can go back to your frame now. Give me that to the page. Abandoned shop. Right there. Is that it? Lumos. You Rebellion. Into here. Lumos. Oh wait, no. Where did you go? You were supposed to come with me. in a bit of a tizzy. I was just scolding some of the plants for spitting and nipping. I suppose it's my own fault for putting more than four to a tray. By the way, Beatrice Green is the name, but you may address me as Madam Green. Okay, Beatrice. Welcome to Dogweed and Death Cap. Oh, mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Oh, if there wasn't the constant demand for antidotes, I wouldn't need to stock so many of the little deers. Except, of course, for curses. And, well, if you've been petrified, then obviously you've come to the right place. <laughs> Mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Or if there's an uprooting, you'll be the next one to drop dead, and I'm in no mood for a clear-up. Are you saying someone died here? Someone died here? Aye. Fortunate, really, that it was just the one. Now then, how may I help you today? I think I'll just have a look around for now. Very well. Let me know if you see anything you like. Rebellion. Dogweed and Death Cap Tree. Right, you. Lumos. Well, what are you showing me? Right outside, Rebellion. I reckon. You're a force to be reckoned with, aren't you? Come on, some of them are really close, and then some of them. Oh, it's right at the top there. I can see it. Rebellion. Oh, what are you? Oh, yeah. Rebellion. 
Oh no, I just opened you. Why are you getting all? Ah, there you are. Lumos. Yeah, I'm just doing this much for a minute later. You got this. It is. Come here. Rebellion. Hogsmeade. <laughs> there they are. He wasn't making it up. Well, we've come this far. Miss Willardsy might get an answer about these butterflies. This way. Slap to follow the bloody blue eyes. Miss Willard's will never believe where the butterflies led me. Two chests. Well. Trophy, you follow the, the butterflies. Me. They got me. What did it get me? I don't know what it got me. Rebellion. Oh, please! You have an answer for me about the butterflies. Indeed, I do. Hello, Miss Willardsy. Well, what happened? Did you find them? Yes, I did. And I was all They ordered. led me into the forest and revealed the treasure. Oh, how lovely! I'm glad you were rewarded for your efforts. Thank you. <sighs> Perhaps one day I'll be able to bring myself to go into the forest. Maybe. For now, I'm happy simply knowing there's something so lovely to see, should I dare. That's a nice outlook. Quest complete, follow the butterflies, collection updated, flower box. Ooh, I got a talent point. What should I spend it on? Right, you. I need to make... Focus potion. While this brews, I'll go check on my plant. Now that's a focus potion done. And now a maximum potion needs to be done. Acquire maximum and endurance potions and use them simultaneously. So let's see, we've got uh, endurance, we've got maximum, we've got focus. Well, I'll have maximum in a second. Just to uh, make good use of them. Bam. 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 Excellent. Right. Ten potions class during the day now. I've done my assignment. I have to go back outside to join the rest of the class when they come in. Turn to Professor Shaw. How are your uh, assignments coming along? Great. I completed your assignments, Professor. Good. You should be ready to learn to pulso. Let's see what you can do. Right, bring it. Concentrate. Do not let your mind wander. To pulso. You've got it now. If you'd like to practice, 
and I think you should, perhaps best not to go flinging your classmates about the halls. I suggest having a go at the enchanted books here. Okay. Um, let's switch to this one. And then add... Dipulso to the right. Oh wait, no, that's Akio. Am I doing Dipulso? Well done. I'm glad to see that you seem staunchly determined to master your spell card. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, that's all good. Next on the list is. What's this? Castle Ramparts. And this goes near Herbology. Come here. Beehives. Glumbumbles. Lumos. Oh, he's giving me more assignments. He's giving me an assignment. Acquire and use an invisibility potion and acquire and use a thunder brew potion against enemies. Alright, Mr. J. Pippin, I need an invisibility and. In the market for potions, are we? Yes, and a thunder brew. What can I do for you today? So, Thunder Brew recipe oh, wow. and invisibility potion. Thank you. All right, let's do some brewing. Let's see. An invisibility potion. Let's start it. Why have you made a storm We're cloud on yourself, bro? Whatever. Here is the flying class. Use the flute for it as well, and there's a staircase there. I'm actually curious where that goes. Oh, this must be her. Whoever teaches flying's uh, pick up. Dear Madam Kogawa, I'm writing. I'm writing to do with Professor Black's decision to cancel Quidditch. As you know, joining official Quidditch team is my utmost dream, and I believe my chances will be now be ruined or at least significantly thwarted. Professor Weasley insists that we must defer to the headmaster and she encouraged us to practice on my own. I advised some challenging trials for myself, but it's not at all the same as practicing on the pitch. Nothing is. Please could I ask that you speak to the headmaster or to Professor Weasley. I shall be miserable my whole life. I can't play Quidditch properly for this entire year. Thank you, Professor P Mel de Reyes. Oh yeah, she's in my house. She likes this Quidditch. I think there's another letter. Dear Madam Cogwa, marvellous news that you will finally be joining the faculty at Hogwarts as our new flying instructor. I dare say our work together at Hogwarts will be less eventful than our time near the Yokohama Harbour, the one never knows. I shall look forward to seeing you soon. If you have any questions in the meantime, please do not hesitate to send me now. Warm regards, Matilda Weasley. Italians and a historian's uniform. It was brilliant solving those old treasure maps. Oh yeah, I remember you dude. Thanks for letting me do it. Alright, let's start the flying lesson. Everybody grab a broom and we shall get started. Mr. Clothen, your attention, please. Sorry, Madam Kagawa. Everyone, please welcome a new student to our flying class. Hello. The goal Hello, everyone. today is to remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick safely. As broom flight is, first and foremost, a means of transportation. Before this using Quidditch. Some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, and loop-the-loops will not be taught or in fact tolerated in this class. We'll leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. Not a fan, <laughs> I take it? Now, let's see how well everyone kept up with their practice over the summer holidays. I've never ridden a broom before. For those who need a refresher, Step up to your broom, say up firmly and clearly, then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Up! That's a gnarly broom. Thank you. Oh, now, she respects her broom. Your turn. Up, 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 you stupid ratty school broom. <laughs> Lawrence, you're doing it wrong. 
Oh. Oh. Ooh, I like my room. One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. There's a story book, which is. Nice, we're in our room. And if you hear my whistle while you're in flight, ground yourself at once. Okay. Ooh, we're out of room. Now, for your first lesson, fly through each ring in the courtyard. Do take care. Ah, the brooms ah, are school I think property. I'm getting the hang of this. I want them returned in one piece. Okay. Nice and easy. How do I get fast like you? Well though? done. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise, shall we? Yes, let's do it. Okay, so what this are we doing? Next set of rings will take you around the grounds for more of a challenge. What a view! <laughs> Hello. Indeed. Huh, that wasn't too bad. Ah, oh, the old boathouse. Wish you could have experienced crossing the lake as the first year. Yep, that would have been nice. But I have seen everything. I've explored most of Hogwarts. Yeah. And this way. Our aquatic resident likes to make an appearance once in a while. <laughs> da -da -da -da. Bye, Mr. Lake, the tentacle, squid. How is he so much faster than me? Oh, did anyone else see that? Thank you. I say, I watched you fly through those rings. You seem to handle yourself on that dusty school broom well enough. Yeah, it's an old broom, isn't it? For something a bit more challenging. Okay. But I'm getting ahead of myself. We haven't probably met. I'm Everett Clopton. Hello, Mr. Clopton. I might be suspecting that a Slytherin like you might be interested in making an escape from class. I like the sound of that. And Can't aren't you a uh, Ravenclaw? Why are you doing what that? did you have in mind? A bit of a detour, so to speak. Follow me. Yeah, let's go on a ride. The tour is about to begin. Follow closely now. Right now, we're flying over the Transfiguration Courtyard. <laughs> Lovely as ever. Let's hope the Headmaster isn't having tea by the window today. Nice to get above it all, isn't it? Yes, indeed. Ahead of the gardens, the Hufflepuff common room windows just peek out. Bit claustrophobic for my taste. Oh, how right there. Flying so quickly. Yeah, how are you handy to know. Lean forward for a burst of speed. Helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. Uh, speed burst. Ooh. Now that's more like it. You sure you're not part hippo grip? There's the famous bridge. Think of all the magic holding it up. I mean, look at it. And I suppose. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? Ooh, I've not been there yet. Flying tips and jaunts around Hogwarts. This is quite the tall Everett. Beautiful elves. This concludes our tour. Let's hurry back. He's still going so much faster than me. Better hurry and hand in our brooms. Dismount here. Uh, how do I? How do I slow down? 
we just jumped off. And where have you two been? Chilling, Bob Dylan. Oh, hello, Professor. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty yes. points will be taken from each of you for not following my instructions. You blew the whistle and we got none. Mr. Clopton, I am disappointed in you. You're in this class because you're I... still because you're still not showing yourself, or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But Professor Enough. Class is finished for the day. As for you, you do well to use better judgment in the future. Just a bit of fun. But okay. Tonight. That was some rather good flying. <laughs> Thank you. Bye, Madam Kogawa. Sorry about that business with Kagawa, but you have to admit those views were worth it. Yep. I have no regrets. It was worth losing a few house points for that detour. You seem at home on a broom. Bet if you had a fancy model, you could fly laps around Imelda. She's Kagawa's favorite. Yeah, I could she show loves her Quidditch. a thing or two if I had my own broom. Hate having to return the school broom after class. Perhaps I have to purchase a broom then. If you can, you should. Wish I could. I want I to. recommend visiting Albie Weeks at Spintwitch's in Hogsmeade. He's always looking to test new models. I'll be weeks. I'll keep an eye out for you in the sky. All right. Flying completed. I wish I could afford my own brain. So if you and my brother's hand me down. Yeah. Sounds I like a Weasley. Like Adam Kagawa. She's been tutoring me after class. Although she is very strict when it comes to how did you fare? If you're keen for some illicit spell practice, meet me outside the Defense Against the Dark Arts classroom. I know a discreet place near there. Ah, oh, Sebastian wants to do something. Spintwitches is open in Hogsmeade. All the latest brooms I hear. Not that I need one. The broom I have at home is the latest. Corridor as soon as you can. I have an idea for somewhere you can focus on your studies. Seventh away floor. From prying eyes and distractions. <gasps> the room of requirement. If I could afford the new Bright Spark broom at Spintwitches, I'd be on it now. Oh, I really want to get that broom though. What do you about you, man? Kagawa? Kagawa, about what happened in class. No need to discuss it further. Losing points for Slytherin should serve as a deterrent against future escapades. I don't now, think it will. Professor Weasley has asked that I teach you a few additional spells, so please keep an eye out for an owl from me. Right. You're also welcome to drop by any time with questions. Okay then. Bye. Bye bye. Hey, Mr. Pippin. I yeah, heard you had a job a for me. Student might need when it comes to potions. Have a good look around. You have a job for me though. You need help with the delivery? Hello, Mr. Pippin. You need help with the delivery? Yes, I do. A capable student such as yourself should have no trouble making the trip to Cambridge. It's just south of Hogwarts. Right, what do you need right. delivered? Fatima Lawang ordered a few invisibility potions. I used to go myself, but lately Fatima has taken to turning every visit into an argument. Right. Constantly complaining about the quality of my stock. But how can I maintain excellence when she orders so often, giving me no time to brew? If you take this Get rather brewer, then. irritating task off my hands, I'd happily allow you to claim the delivery fee from Fatima. Hmm. Well, happy to help. I'd be happy to help with the delivery. And I get paid. have no idea how grateful I am. Truly. Here are the invisibility potions she requested. Hopefully she won't give you too much trouble. She's a talented potioner in her own right. I dare say I wouldn't mind having a look at her potion recipes one day. Alright, well, I'll do that, but first I'm gonna go get a broom. Right, this is the shop. Let's go in. Ah, oh, new face! Wonderful! Yes, field guide page. Ooh, trophy challenge accepted. Complete all tiers of a challenge. So I've got all the run by LB, yep. And got all field guide pages in Hogsmeade. Yay! Rebellion. Uh, give me a second, I just want to check a few things, what's in here? You plum velvet robe. But nothing else. Alright, let's have a chat. Hello, 
Mr. Weeks, is it? Albie Weeks at your service. Welcome to Spin Witches. Apologies if you came by before and weren't able to come in. Shop's been closed since trade routes were disrupted. Had to travel as far as London to meet with my supplier. Right, and I've right. only just returned. Thankfully, with inventory. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Yes, Got I want one. Got a few weavers available. Ember dash, silver arrows. Mm. Wind wisps, too. No matter what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. Right. Uh... Disrupted. You said disrupted trade routes caused you to close, Spint Witches. Terrible it's been. Trade routes reported as unusable. Evidently criminals were overtaking roads, threatening hamlets. Wow. I can fly safely almost anywhere. But you try flying with an inventory of brooms on your back. No easy feat. You look right like then, a target as well. Back to work. If a particular broom takes your fancy, just let me know. Right. What else can you share about Do brooms? Do you mind sharing more about your brooms? I have a passion for them. Every detail of every model. Take wind wisps, well known for their quality ash handles. You weavers are rare because some fear flying them, likely to do with the U one's darker reputation. Then you have the ember dash, known for its handsome appearance. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Working with brooms every day makes me practically giddy. It's one of many reasons I cherish running this shop. Right. Well, I'll have a look. Sounds quite the array of brooms. I'll have a look around. Thank you. What are we looking for today? Anyway, let's see. Perfect broom for those with a fiery temperament. Ember dash. Hogwarts house broom. Broom which trying to celebrate your particular Hogwarts house pride. Moon trimmer broom. This broom is built for stability. A stylish broom with a light touch, quite literally. Comfortably comfortable and speedy broom with a unique woven design. But let's look them all. That item is of the highest quality. Hmm, looks alright. Mm, not really liking that. Not liking that either. Not liking that. That item is of the highest quality. I don't like that either. I'm liking this. Let's get this. You'll be thrilled with that broom. I promise you. All right. Thanks for the broom. Whilst nearly any broom will certainly be a step up from the practice brooms in Kagawa's class, they all have their limitations. You seem to be a flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancement. I can Go enhance on. my broom. Ha! Knew I was right about you. I think you'll be quite happy with the performance of any broom at lower altitudes. But you may notice that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise. Yeah. I believe I can remedy this issue. I have some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, if you will, that will improve the performance of any broom you fly. Right. What I need is someone to conduct the broom flight and report back to me so I can perfect the upgrades. As it happens, another Hogwarts student, Imelda Reyes, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. If you were to compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved, I could complete work on my first upgrade. What really? Say? Uh, how did your passions for brooms? That's you quite had random. Passion for brooms. Random Since question. the moment I saw my first Quidditch match, seeing flyers manoeuvre the way they do, oh, some people continue to have their doubts about me and my ideas. I hope that won't dissuade you from helping. I know I'm onto something. It sounds like it. But why am I the right person? Why for this? do you need me to report to you on this broom flight? I did try to get Imelda to help, but she has some flying habits and quirks that made her difficult to collaborate with. I need a flyer with no bad habits and the knack for flying. Your classmate Everett said you're a natural on a broom. He He's quick. forever in here studying the newest models, almost as passionate about brooms as I am. If your rumoured talent for flying can help you beat Imelda's times, then having you assess the broom will be invaluable. Right. You took Manuel Kagawa's class? You took Kagawa's class. I did. But my focus on the technical elements of brooms rather than the art of flying drove her mad. She thinks it fitting I run spint witches now. I don't reckon either of us ever pictured me batting away bludgers for the cannons or Puddle Me United. And I find a certain satisfaction in winning over the naysayers who think I may be too young to run this shop. With your help, I can continue proving myself the most knowledgeable purveyor of wizarding sporting goods around. Hmm. Well, sounds like a try. That sounds Worth a try. intriguing. 
I'll see what I can do. Thank you. It'll be worth your while. If I'm right, the new upgrade ought to enhance brooms in every regard. And I can give you a special price. The time trial should be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Rays will sort you out. Once you've beaten Imelda's time, be sure to let me know. All right, hugs me to send other areas, pivot flangs. Look for no flying icon near the main map to learn when you can. Yes, I can see. That. I can't help but admire Mr. Weeks's enthusiasm. All right, time to fly. Let's go. Woohoo, this is so much quicker. Hey, birdies. I like my broom is like I got fire coming out of my butt. Hey, Mr. Dragon. Can I fit through there? Oh, I did it. <laughs> oh, I'm an expert flyer. Anyway, we're near Quidditch, Quidditch pits and that. Hmm, what's this? Caged bathtub. Quidditch pitch. All right. Time to enter this place. Hello, you guys. Uh, nobody cares. Let's go in. Revelio. That had it cancelled it. We wouldn't be looking for the blasted thing in the first place. Where are you? Revelius. Saying it wrong. Are they looking for a snitch? Revelia. Much better. Oh, shut up. Wait. Accio. Oh, they're trying to get He's the quaffle. my entire school year. I hope Puffskin goes up his nose and snaps his brain. Hello, I have arrived. If Take part in whatever Slytherin's this is. This is newest brim talent. Yes, it is. Um, what's this thing? Oh. I don't know what that is. There you are. But the cross one's duel is to beat. Hey. Uh, Imelda. Hello, Imelda. Albie Week sent me. <laughs> Did he now? Still tinkering with his broom upgrade, no doubt. I tried to help him once. He nitpicked my flying technique, and that was the end of that. The right. Why is he whooping you into his broom testing silliness? You've barely started flying from what I know. Okay, Caught chill out. showing off in flying class with Clopton. Chill out. Sound jealous. See, someone's jealous of my skills on a broom. Me, Slytherin Quidditch captain, jealous of you. Yeah. Everyone knows that class is only for beginners, troublemakers, and bumbling baboons. But for some reason, now people think you're competition. Ugh, I can't be having that. Perhaps I am competition. You Perhaps. can't be what passes for Slytherin these days. Pff, ragged old hats dropping at standards. Enough of this. Only one way to find out who's the better flyer. I hold one of hey, the she dissed the sorting cart. That's not very nice. Let's see if you can beat it. Slytherin versus Slytherin. What sort of courses are these? Can you tell me more about these courses? <laughs> Stalling, fifth year. Fine, I'll humor you. Are you not a fifth year? This course demands you focus. Requires you to anticipate speed and height before every turn. Right, the others right. test stamina. Three courses in all. Fell ages ago by former students. Since Black cancelled Quidditch, it was these courses or nothing. I made them popular again. Got the whole school hungry to compete. So, let's see what you've got, fifth year. Okay, let's go then. Actually, why not? I can beat your record. I'm so looking forward to seeing you lose. Let's do this. What are these things? Ooh, they made me go faster. Oh, I missed him.
Success. I'm missing a few of these, but I think that's okay. Without hogs be now. Now in it, Aaron Shire, I think it's called. No, the Hogwarts train tracks. Let's keep it going. I think we're done. I beat her like by like nearly a minute. Hi, I did great. Uh, that's not. You, you must have cheated. You. Uh, I didn't. Fine. You won. Yes, I did. Don't think this is over. You can't determine skill from one single trial. Well, you got like two minutes somewhere, and something. I got one minute thirty seven. You're not so. terrible, but you're still going to have to prove yourself if you want to earn my respect. Do I want your respect? I don't want your respect. I don't want respect from the likes of you. All you do is insult people. You and yeah. everyone else need to get a thicker skin. Anyway, I'm moving on to the next course. It's near Irondale and offers a much tougher challenge. You can try to prepare by racing this course again. Just check in at the podium where the leaderboard is. You can check your time and start the race. We'll, well see already next time it, if so. your win here was more than just a fluke. Whilst on an errand for Albie Weeks. Alright, bye.